Good afternoon everybody, it's Denise here, Denise Junk Journals UK. Thank you so much for joining me, it is lovely to have you here. So it is um, the day for the Christmas uh, journal uh, to be worked on. I have finished the cover so I'm going to share that with you. I have sewn in the signature but I haven't done anything since that, just sewn it in and left it. So um, I'll have a look at the pages and what, what have you with you. I'm going to put this on the cover here. Um, but first of all, I'll show you what I've got on it. So um, I've just backed that lovely, it looks like it's got glue on him. I only saw it when the light shone on. I don't want to take the picture off though. I might have to stay gluey. I might have to put a bit of glitter on his nose. <laughs> it's his nose. Make him into Rudolph. Um, yeah, so it was the front of a card, a Christmas card that I cut down. I've put it on some hessian or burlap, whatever you call it, whoops, which will fray. I put a faux brass plaque in to give it a, a title. Um, I stitched some more of the material. I found some more of the material that was on the outside onto another um, envelope. So this is two big envelopes stuck together. Are you too close there, do you think? It might be. Um, both covered in this material and then stuck together and I did put a strip of card down the middle just to give it a little bit of strength inside so it's not it's popping open because of that card because it's thicker than than the rest of it but as it gets used that will well it'll either protect it because it'll be a gator mouth and um, I don't intend to do that but you never know <laughs> um or it will soften up and, you know, become as soft as the rest of the cover. It is beautiful, though. Quite a few of you said what lovely material. I did do a journal in this either last year or the year before. I can't remember it is. It is lovely material. Really pleased with it. And it goes lovely with, um, I'm calling it the rustic papers, these. So this is going to be rustic Christmas uh, journal. So you can see that I've stitched it in red. <laughs> um, I probably will put something over there, though. But the red may well show. Now, I have got some red lace. I, I didn't bring it to put down there but let's let's have a look let me open it because it'll be very shiny for you to look at it's um the same modern lace as the green that I had oh it is quite nice actually mm. I don't know I'll have to try it with white and with the red and then decide um but yeah something like that down the side yeah it was gifted to me by Tanya thank you um and I have got this, which um, I got today from the antique shop, which I'll talk to you more about once we get crafting. This is just a piece of what it is on the outside. It's a big few metres of it there. And I wondered about, um, you know, putting t just tying it at the side with some of that through a um, an eyelet. don't know if that's the colour I want. I just loved it. It's kind of Christmassy. Or if I just want some plain... I don't know, but I intend to fasten it with eyelets and something. <laughs> Maybe that. So let's let's have a look at it inside. Um, oh, while I was sewing it together, I stitched a piece of lace down the front inside cover. I really wanted to see all that beautiful fabric, if if truth be told. And I thought if I stick something, you know, pocket on there, because I was thinking, do I want to sew a pocket on or something? And I thought I really don't want to hide it. And then I thought, oh, a lace belly band, and it can either be on show or when somebody owns it. You know, they can put, well, you can put lots of things in there. You could put Christmas cards, shopping lists, all sorts of things, photograph, um, you know, still see what's going on around it. I'll have nothing, just just enjoy the beautiful material. <laughs> um, this was the page that was the scrapbooking paper. And I said I was going to put some ribbon, either top or bottom or both. Well, I went for bottom and because it's this lovely wide ribbon, I hope you can see it okay without the, I was going to say the sun shining on it then, without the light shining on it. And it's it's like wired. It's quite nice. So I stitched it on as a pocket, just on one side. So it'll be a pocket here and one in the back. Um, yeah, and it just made that page a little bit longer look because it's it's a trim on the back. I quite like the wire on it. Now I did turn it round the edge there. I haven't actually glued it. Can you see that? But I might. I couldn't decide if I wanted it, you know, to trim it. It's stitched, it's stitched there. But if I wanted to trim it flat, I might just glue it down. Um, so that's that. I put washi on both sides of this card because it does sometimes um, split. It's not card, it's scrapbook paper, but it's thick. So this is the rustic um, papers that, if you saw this last time, I told you I was putting in. I have inked the edges of them. 
um, that's under my coffee dye and it did have a little rip in it and I've just put a lovely piece of, I, I did drag out all my um, Christmas washes um, and I've got them all in the little tub ready to go. So um, yeah, I've put some of that there as well. I dragged it out for this. <laughs> um, so yeah, I've got those ready to use. But yeah, I'm, I'm loving the rustic um, images and colours, I think, here of these papers. I know the blue's not, well it is kind of, isn't it? It's like a, a wood, nice blue wood colour. So yeah, it seems to, oh, I put the green, how oh, well has that held because it's, oh you're a bit loose, are you a bit loose? <laughs> I'm either loose or I rip the papers, I don't know, I might put some, um, some washi on there and there, it's not loose, it's tight, but it is, it is moving. Maybe the eye of my needle was a bit a bit big. Anyway, I put a green um, a green envelope in there, which would be nice, won't it, with some Christmas images on it? Definitely. <coughs> Excuse me. That lovely Christmas Carol page. That's Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer, <laughs> and we've got it next to a reindeer or an elk or whatever you would call that. Of this little robin down here cute they are lovely papers and i'm going to make another one with these papers because like i say it was there was more than one set of papers in the um, in the pack i won't do it on camera but you may well see it at some point it will make its way to etsy hopefully if i get it done in time for christmas yeah then same at the back i've just got this um over the oh, bit of bit of washi stuck on there come off just tipped it round the corner look i think i will glue it down i don't dislike it on there and then we've got that lovely pocket again there. I didn't uh, put a belly band in there. Um, I didn't want to do the same front and back. I think I'll just leave that because you can clip things. Yeah, maybe something clipped on the top would be nice. It's just gorgeous material, isn't it? So that's um, that's the journal as it is. What was I saying about the inside? I can't remember. Oh, no, I was telling you about it. Yeah, it'll probably there'll be another one of these that will make it to Etsy. Um, and I have put everything in my, everything, I've only got, I think there's three journals, might be two, maybe three journals now, because a couple of them went straight away. Um, I've put them on 25% sale um, until Christmas Eve, day before Christmas Eve, I think. So if you're after a journal, there's, there are only some smallish ones in there now, but um, I, I've looked on it and when I look at it, you don't see the sale price unless you click on the actual item. So if you've been on and had a look, um, the price they are might not be the price you're looking at. So click on the item um, and it will come up with it. It does come up with the sale price. The big one went straight away. <laughs> I have to say, so, um, you know, there's people that I guess they favourite Etsy and they watch it and they come up straight away. So um, anyway, what was I doing? Don't let me forget this because I've got this last time. So I said I would do a giveaway, didn't I? So let me just show you what's in it. It's just some Christmas ephemera. So um, this is from last year, not this year. It, it is scrapbooking paper, that. And it, it's not an... No, it is just a um, journal card with one of my fabric and lace snippets on it. So that's part of it. This that I made out of the book page on one of the Saturdays, which is coming round again tomorrow. So I think they're Victoria Design Papers and that's scrapbooking paper. And it's just got a lovely, what's one of those? Scrap pad <laughs> in the middle, tear pad. So that and that, but they're all blue. This I made the other day and I've just, I just quickly made up out of my uh, scraps, a journal card or a tag to go in it. So three pieces there, one of these little baggies. I went crazy with all the gold in. And then there are 15 Christmas stamps. I think they're all British Christmas stamps, used ones. Put the nice in your journal, so I'm just gonna put those in there. Okay, so um, what I will do is I will just enter everybody in the draw who's commented um, on the Christmas videos because I'll assume if you're watching the Christmas ones that, you know, Christmas is your thing. And then, yeah, if you don't want them, <laughs> you can either put in the in the comments, don't enter me, or, you know, when I draw you, if I draw you and you don't want them, you can just let me know you don't want them. Um, so that's that. I will do that uh, probably Sunday. I'll draw it Sunday so that I can get it in the post to whoever. Um, not this. What we're going to put in this? Let me get some. I don't know. Oh, let's go through some of the uh, ephemera that 
we got I can't remember what I did with it this is the problem with only doing it twice a week now I have had a very hectic day my brain is not uh... yeah these were all going in I think weren't they oh yeah that was just glued um yeah we we were tried we had an attempted break-in last night someone tried to break in our our front door well this morning three o'clock this morning and would you believe that Simba woke us up so he heard the commotion woke us up and um, he made a commotion but he was at the top of the stairs I went to see what was up with him and he was just staring down the stairs in uh, horror on his face and um, yeah they had they had hold of the handle of the outside of the door and they broke it off and um, they were going for the barrel but obviously I put the light on and said to Neil hey there's someone trying to get in the house and with that they'd they'd scarpered but I you know the handle of our door was then on our lawn broken and the locksmith said yeah they've they've come for that posh car in your drive well that posh car in our drive is our next door neighbor's car and it was in his drive we've got we've kind of got a shared drive that goes round in you know in a, a semicircle I guess so you know it does it could look like it's our car like we have two cars because ours was at the side so yeah we were kind of lucky I guess because they didn't get in because what they would have done was stolen our car keys and then realized they didn't didn't work on that and goodness knows what they would have done but oh anyway it uh it put our day out completely yeah these are all for in here I'm sure they are so let me just grab them out these are what we were working on aren't they um so I'm really really late filming because yeah waiting for the locksmith and oh I don't know you know things just take a lot longer when you've had a little bit of a shock so we're all okay and they didn't get in all they've done is caused some buildings damage I guess so bit of bit of money before Christmas we could have done without spending but other than that you know it would have been worse if they'd got the car or just got taken the car keys and you know we were then left with just a spare car key shall we have a look and see what we want to put in it now so yeah I think I'm definitely going to put that on there I do like that on there we also had somewhere I don't know what I've done with it I found a little oh it'll turn up when I tidy up anyway a little red um shiny glittery i don't know where it's gone <laughs> brad that uh, tanya sent me and it's going to be beautiful on here so right let's see if i can organize myself to do a bit of crafting there it is it was right there look it, not, i'm hiccuping i'm sorry i have just bolted a cup of coffee down because i was thirsty yes yeah, so we were going to spend the day well this afternoon out at the antiques um shop which is our favorite thing to do we spent all morning working and uh yeah we were waiting for the the man didn't know that was in there <laughs> the locksmith but he came so we did manage to go for an hour but everything's been a bit of a rush these are a bit shiny are they shining on you but i was thinking these have got some um I've had these a couple of christmases as well these have got some kind of rustic that blue's nice isn't it so I might cover a couple of the backs of these or maybe just put a couple in as they are in this journal. Anyway, I'm just showing you things because my, main, my mind's just going all over, isn't it? So what do we want in this? We want, I think, a nice big journal card in there. And I'm thinking maybe either a lovely page from a Christmas book made into a journal card or an old Christmas card because I've got lots of those in my box. So I think, yeah, I think a nice big journal card in there. When we do... Um, embellishing it probably a label one of those where are they i put them in here didn't I? the tim holtz bits i put them in with this one didn't i oh, maybe i didn't i thought i had must have given them their own little in here. gosh it's hot i've got my big jumper on because it's really cold yeah they are really cold outside um I think it's four degrees but the wind's making it more like freezing it's a bit a bit of cold so uh yeah I've had a big jump on and coming from a cold some cold shopping that's pretty um i was just seeing if there's a lovely label for up there <laughs> well i thought about it yeah and the heating's on high to, to warm the place up and whew, i'm now melting well as you can probably gather i don't think it's going to be a huge um the thing is, I don't know about the card, do I, that's going in front of it. Yeah, it's not going to be a hugely long video. One, because it's late and I need to get it up. And two, my brain's, 
scatterbrain, scatterbrain. That's what I was wondering. Was there a like that's the kind of thing I was looking for? Cool, yeah. Just a plain label. What I'll do is I'll tuck it in there. And that one's quite nice as well, isn't it? I'll tuck them both in there and then decide which one I want when we've chosen the um, the card. Handy those pockets for things like that, aren't they? Um, now. I think that can be journaled on. It can certainly be written on with a white pen, couldn't it? Oh, a gold pen. That would be nice. Lovely gold pen on there. So I will leave that alone for journaling. Again, we will embellish it. Maybe I'll do some embellishing. That's nice and easy, isn't it? And um, that can't be journaled on. So I could put a pocket or a side tuck on there. But will it interfere with that? I think a side tuck might be nice. Um, that can be journaled on. Let's do some embellishing on the pages that are good for journaling and we're not going to put anything on. So we'll start here. That'd be a nice, easy thing to do. I just remembered this. I do love... Yeah, as we're going through, we'll see where this goes because I definitely want this in. I love this flower fairy, holly fairy. And he, you know, he's perfect for this. So as we go through each page, I mean, he'd be nice on there, but that is lovely for journaling. So he's not going on there. As we go through, we'll find somewhere for him. So shall we start with some Martin Holtz? Because like I said, I'm determined to use them up. My hand camera, yeah. So like I say, lots of journaling. So I don't want to put too much on it. Let's dig some bits out. Uh, nice, I think we put that on one of the pockets the other day, didn't we? Oh, I've got this lovely doggy. He's just so gorgeous, isn't he? We don't want him with the deer anyway, and we've got deer on there, so... Um, I think the Christmas trees, no. Not the right size. We've got berries on there, too small. Oh, that's nice. A bright Christmas note. Just bear with. <laughs> I will find what I want, I'm sure. Smaller tree. Just want a bit of something. I don't want to put Christmas Day on it, even though I love that, because I want to put that later, further on in the um, in the journal. No, there's nothing in the Tim Holtz that's grabbing me for that page, so I'll have a look in the other. Who know the labels and oh Santa's workshop. Mm, maybe. Let's have a look in here. There was these, weren't there? I think that's a Tim Holtz uh, piece. Too big though. December. Um Again, it's too big and I don't want to rip that down. I like the bits that surround it. We're not doing pink. And we've got some lovely die cuts. Be nice on that wood. Right, let's look in here. I feel like I've got that somewhere as well. Did we put that on one of the pockets we might have done? <laughs> Gosh. Some foliage, a wreath. Which way does the wreath go? No, sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think that's the one. I love a piece of holly. Yeah, and he's going to go in the corner nice, isn't he? And he has got white round him. And I'm going to leave the white round it because it makes it stand out. Uh, oh, I've got all this out. <laughs> makes it stand out from that wood grain colour. Yeah, so I don't know if I had any other news for you because that's <laughs> that's all that's on our minds now. I got um, my glue delivery today <laughs> from Amazon, which I was waiting for. So I've got glue sticks and I've got Fabri-Tac and now I'm thinking I should probably have ordered some of this. Some art glitter. So oh, we've um, also ordered a ring doorbell, which we've been talking about since we... Uh, moved into the house so we probably should have done it by now and then we'd have known what they were up to but yeah we've ordered one of those today so that will be here on Amazon tomorrow and Neil will fit it and then 
Do you think that wants a word across there? I think it might. If I can find one I like. Oops. I like that, but it's completely the wrong colour. Right, let's take the big things out so I can see the words. <laughs> words are in here, aren't they? Yes, I see them. That's it. Out you come, you lot. That lovely holly there. Oh, there's another Christmas stamp. I've got thousands of Christmas stamps. Well, that's a nice one though. Look, that might be nice in the book. Okay, thankful. I think you're too big. Want something thinner? No. I don't want just to say Christmas all the time. North Pole. Holiday. I quite like that one. That's got a bit of a... It's still too big to go on that road. Maybe that side. Hmm. Yeah, I need to print some more off. Silent night. Too big. They're all too big. All seasons greetings. Be nice on a scroll that. Lots of pink ones. What do you say? May all your dreams be merry and bright nice I think that's gonna be wish I'd put that lower down now look yeah it's just it's not in the right place are you a Merry Christmas as well yeah it's gonna be one of those days where I just can't find anything I want it is the season no I'm afraid the words aren't doing anything for me either <laughs> okay let's move on that looks nice with that actually. That stamp doesn't it? Somewhere. I oh, like the holiday one maybe. Perhaps going down at an angle, yes. Let's do that. Where's Dubber? Ooh. Well, I did have my desk quite clear and tidy now. It's just full, absolutely full of Christmas stuff. <laughs> it's full like my brain. Anyway, what a hero old Simba is, eh? <laughs> Everyone says. So, yeah, we told the, the chap that lives next door that it's most likely his car. He's got some kind of a sports BMW fancy, you know, the sort that they like to steal and chop up. And I'm guessing, well, the, the, the locksmith said there's been a spate of them, but we've seen a few police cars around lately as well. So I'm guessing it's... Uh, it's that time of year when people are after more money, I guess. Be it legally or illegally. That's a lovely picture, isn't it? What did I say about that? I can't remember. I'm not even going to fight my brain today. I'm just going to just keep moving on. <laughs> did I have a lovely, I had a lovely robin -y thing somewhere, didn't I? No, it was that. Oh, isn't that? That would be a nice tuck on there, I don't think. It would be a tuck and then, you know, you could just have it as decoration and journal. Or you could journal and then put something in front of it. I do like that on there, actually, and I think it is strong enough. Um, lost my dopper again. <laughs> what did I do with it? What you watching? It is strong enough for something not too heavy and it is only a single signature journal, so it really shouldn't become a, a monster. It'd be nice to do a a small one after the the couple of bigish bigish ones I've done. I if I go quite well down here, gluing it on, should hold it fine. Yeah, I'm eager, I'm eager to get some bits in this, and like, like I say, I'm not going to overfill it because I do want it. I would like someone to buy it and use it. <laughs> yeah, like that. So we're not putting anything in there, we're putting a big card in there, that's for journaling, can't remember, oh I know, I said a side, some, some probably lace again, a nice side, that, um, this lace would be nice because this is rustic as well isn't it, this crocheted cotton, it's not, it's not wide enough Denise for a 
side took. So maybe some wider, or it could go on some paper and make it a side tuck. I'm going to cut a piece off and leave it in there so I remember. <laughs> yeah, I think if I put it on a piece of something and make a nice full full length page tuck, side tuck. That's in the wrong pocket, never mind. Yeah, I think that'd be lovely on there. Hmm. Maybe some book page out of a Christmas book, something. We'll see. Yep, like that. Um, don't know about that. I've got some washy down the side of that. Maybe at the, across the bottom or the top. Let's have a look. What We've got this beautiful owl here and a green wreath. Um, hmm. What do you say? Christmas. Merry Christmas. We don't want Merry Christmas everywhere, do we? So this one was the green snowflakes. Oh, that's quite a nice, oops, quite a nice green compared to that wreath, I think. And like I say, these were, I think these were last Christmas's washes, so using them would be good. I didn't use much of anything last year. Yeah, quite like that on that. I'm going to put some glue. That's sitting there without its lid. So remember, if you want this journal and you, you know, you want to secure it <laughs> before it goes in Etsy, if you um, email me or message me if you are on my messenger, I can give you a price. Not that I know one right now, but I will think about it and give you a price. Um, and you don't, you know, if I give you a price and you don't want it, you don't have to feel bad just saves me um, listing if someone definitely wants it because it's not so much um, what you pay Etsy because I know they take um, fees but you know they, they do they do a fair bit for the money I think I guess that's it sometimes seems a lot on cheaper things but um, it's not the fee so much as the you know the sitting down and the typing and the photographing and all that that's um, for me is the bugbear of, of Etsy other than that it's a really good wondering about that lovely stamp which I liked it's not really the red of those at all is it no so that may well have an envelope tucked over it that one I think because again that could be written on in a beautiful gold pen we ought to see if I can find a gold pen to go with this didn't I um might embellish that but I'm not putting anything on it and might put another vellum pocket on the bottom of there i'll see so this holly which i i wasn't sure was the right way up and i'm still not sure but there you go <laughs> um let's have a look well let's have a look at the things we made first because yeah pocket might be nice on that one oh there's there's holly i quite liked that one didn't i i still quite like that one Holly on Holly. Were there any tickets that went with it? I think that was it, wasn't it? Was it? Yeah, I think it was. And this one had one as well, didn't it? Was this one with this one then? Yeah. Yes, I think that's right. That one with that one. What do we think? Yeah, I like that. Let's put her down before I change my mind. I inked it and everything, didn't I? Yes. Yeah, definitely. Oh, we've made a decision and put a pocket in. I wasn't sure we'd even get that far. My brain must be settling down. I've also got a bit of a upset tummy. Oops. Seeing as I'm sharing all my, <laughs> all my woes with you today. Nothing drastic, but it's, it's a bit gripey, so I'm... Um, I'm having some chicken soup for tea, <laughs> which will be nice. I'll tell you what, it's the weather for soup today. And, um, yeah, it'll be a television evening, definitely. We came, we came home this afternoon. The cat's been in most of the day. He's been out to the toilet, but... Um, Get a bit of fresh air, but it's not been out long, not like he used to. 
and uh, we came in he was in his little bed and i went through to the kitchen earlier today not tonight went through to the kitchen and um, looked out the window and there's a lovely little black well it was a kitten it's not so much i suppose it is a kitten now but it used to be a tiny kitten i'm sure you've heard me talk about it before the one that used to have the bell round its neck it hasn't anymore all curled up in simba's room on simba's bed <laughs> like he owned the place the sun was there was sunshine out and it was coming through the um greenhouse i sometimes call it a conservatory you know so if i'm talking about the conservatory i'm really talking about the greenhouse i really like that that's nice isn't it pleased with that so i'll just pop her in there while that dries and stick a piece of paper in um yeah so neil had to go out now it didn't run away when he went into the the greenhouse it just looked at him like oh he had to actually put his hand behind its bottom and kind of encourage it no nice for writing on with a gold pen i feel that this needs something up here doesn't it we'll just put that up there ready because we want this one in as well um yeah so uh, he doesn't I, I don't know if the friends or what can't work it out he doesn't fight with this one whereas this like um well, another coloured white and something cat that, I, you know, when I go out. Is that nice? Excuse me, not when I go out. I have to go out because I hear him, well, swearing and chasing and howling. You know what cats are like when they're falling out. Yet with this black one, he doesn't do that. I often go out, but I have I've thrown water near the black cat to get rid of it before. So he doesn't like me. Oh, it might be nice down there amongst that. I like that. Let me look in the camera. Mm, ish. <laughs> um, some of these are going to make nice. Uh, what are those other things? They put lots of them together. <laughs> yes. Oh dear. They are clusters. That's it. They make nice clusters. This doggy again. <laughs> Let's put him with the nice stuff. Nope, nothing there. Where's my little tin gone? Is it? Is there anything here appealing to me? What was I saying about that? Yeah, so I, I don't know. I think they may well be friends. Mm. I don't think uh, I don't think Simba's sure either. <laughs> There's that again. Look, that I keep wanting to use. That would be nice there. But I'm sure it's on something else. So I might be dreaming. Well, there's another Robin. Look on her the right colour not really keep going there's plenty to choose from <laughs> oh i love this one I, oh i absolutely love this picture I, I printed it out so many times the first year i got this i think this is from nanine a collage type well i know it's from nanine but i don't know if it's on one of her kits or if it's on one of um tanya's giveaways maybe tanya will tell me one of her freebies just love it. Let's leave it there a minute and see. See if that's a place for it. There's another one there. I just love it, don't you? <laughs> I'm, I'm asking you a lot of questions today, aren't I? Who's answering me? Aren't I? Oh, it's a mistletoe. That's nice as well. Let's keep that out. Um, yeah, a few of these are from Nanine's and Tanya's. Uh, Planners, Christmassy planners, I think. Right, you've had enough fun looking through that and playing, Denise. Get something. Oh, that's quite nice in the middle of there, isn't it? <laughs> I just liked that. I just sat there on its own. Should we have these birds hanging up here? Still room to to write around it, isn't there? Or stick a you can stick a picture at the bottom or. Do you think they go? I don't know, but I'm just going to put them on because I'm leaving the white again. I just love them. They've got to go in because this is going to be one of my favourite ist journals this year. I think this, you know, Christmas journals. I know it's the first one, real one I've done apart from the December daily, which I loved. But um. Yeah, the papers. I'm just loving the papers. They're rusticy. 
papers. Like I say, I'm hoping to make a couple for presents as well, but whether I'll get there, I don't know, because goodness me, time is flying. Flying by. And we are doing a lot in the house. We've now got two of the four cupboards up that's going up in the kitchen. And uh, yeah, they, they took a bit of doing. So there's two more to go, which we're hoping when the plaster, the plastering, the replastering um, need, that Neil did, the filling where the boiler was, it needs rubbing down now, making square before they can go up. Oh, they're just beautiful, aren't they? I do love that there, but I'm not going to put it there. I think I like the plainness next to this, and like I say, that is going to be nice for um, come out now for some journaling with a, a blue pen. Okay, how long have I been? I'm all right yet. It's actually, it's nice and thick, that. I must have put it on some really thick card. It's mistletoe, so it go either way. You could have it hanging that way from the top, or you could have it standing up. Um, yeah, it's thick, so it'd make a nice tuck, is what I was thinking. He's just too beautiful to cover, isn't he? And again, he can be written round. Um, we're still in the first half of the signature yet. Again, this one's lovely for journaling. That one's too pretty to put anything on. That might have something, you know, attached to it. Right, now, I haven't, I don't think, got anything in mind for here. Do we want this on? Gosh, you barely fit, but you do just fit. Do we want the holly in the middle? What would happen on the inside then? Um, I might attach something to that so it's another page. I definitely want some dangles on here. Um, I don't want to put some Christmassy charms in as well. And I've got bells and all sorts. So, um, do we want it on there? Do we want it in the middle? No, I like him on there. Because this is going to be brilliant journaling, isn't it? And... What does it look like without that in? Could go higher up with a bit of green at the bottom. Ooh, with some of that. Ooh. Maybe not this one. No, but some green trim. Some of that lovely green there, maybe. Across the bottom. That's nice. Okay, let's put it on, shall we? We've still got... About eight minutes, seven minutes. There'll be another thing done when I, I need to do as much as I can. Am I going up a bit? Yeah. Um, do I want it all down? Yeah, I'm going to stick it all down for security. I don't think it's strong enough for another, another tag behind. What was I saying? Yeah, because I'm only doing it twice a week on camera. I need to do as much as I can for you guys to see. So next time you see this, it will be embellishing it and then it'll be it'll be done. So it should should have all its pockets and things put in because I don't want to don't want to take right up to December to get it done. And we're only <laughs> we're seven days away from December, something like that. Yeah, so next time you see this it'll be embellishing and then done in a, a few days' time. We've got it's Saturday tomorrow, isn't it? So we've got Saturday um book page. And Sunday, I'm supposed to be doing stash, aren't I? Going through my stash and using it on Sunday. So it'll be something like that. Oh. I threw these little things all over the floor. These little brads lot. I dropped the pot and the pot is a little small round pot and it's rolled under my desk. So I need Neil to go on his hands and knees under there and grab it. Okay, so this is going to fray till it's glued. So let's get some glue down. My new, my new fabric tax come as well. So when this one's empty, we'll have another fresh start with the. I was going to say nib. Is it the nib? This is it a nib spout? What is it? I can't remember. <laughs> oh, fed up of saying I can't remember tonight. 
nozzle. There you go. It was an N. I knew it was an N. Well, I didn't, to be fair. <laughs> but that's why I was thinking nib, because it's an N. That's it. It's getting a bit gloopy, that one. So if we put it in right where it needs to be on that side. And then this side I'll trim when it's whoops when it's dry and I've got a bit of glue sticking out there. If I shut that on anything, it will be glued tight forever. <laughs> Let me cut the envelope open. Yeah, so that could have a little word or something down there, couldn't it? I could even put a piece of it across the top. Oh, let go. Oh, that's quite nice. Do you think that's nice? Let's do it. Kind of finishing the edge, isn't it? Yeah, I'm going to, because I'm on the edge there, I'm going to put a piece of paper behind it because, did I cut a piece? Yeah, because this is coming out quite thick and gloopy today. Well, it has been for a few days, actually. I'm way, way, way behind with my comments. I don't know what's up with me. I'm just lazy when I sit down, I think. Truth be told, once I sit down, I don't want to do anything. <laughs> you know, sit down at the end of the day, which is when, or first thing in the morning, which is when I normally do my uh, comments. So I will, I do read them as they come through, like I say, but it's just replying. If I get too many, I go through and just put a, a thumbs up and a smiley. Unless you ask me something specific, then I do try and answer. But yeah, I appreciate all the, the good wishes and the hellos and the information that you're sending me. That's nice on the back, that as well. Yeah, I like that, pleased with that. So yeah, I need to put something else on there so it's a double. I could put another envelope on it, I'll see. I do have one. There you go there. So yeah, three more minutes and then I need to move on. So let's see what else we can get put in. So we'll try and get this in the back. As soon as we've got one in the front, where did we put it? So on the holly. don't necessarily want to put it on the same. Now we put holly on holly. Now we've got here stags and a stag. So shall we, shall we put the stags on the stag? I think we will, because that's going to be tricky to write on as well, isn't it? Yeah, and they're all done and inked and ready to go. Let's put the lid on that. There we go. Silence while I breathe. <laughs> I'm not telling you to be silent. I'm saying that's what you're getting from me. Yeah, my cheeks are burning. <laughs> it's definitely warm in here, which is nice. That's good. I'm not complaining. And Neil has got quite a few more days off yet, actually. I don't know why I thought for a minute it was going back to work Monday, but it's not. I've 10 days off. He said I'm rushing him back to work. <laughs> I just can't count days. So. Why well, yeah, I was trying to work through what I'm going to be doing, wasn't I? So Saturday is book page. Sunday will be whatever I'm doing from my stash to use it up. Stash or scraps, one of the two. Monday... I might, depends if I get to it or not. Monday might be this. Oh no, Monday should be the, the shabby dabby doo -da, the shabby journal. Should be finished Monday. The one with the beautiful cover that you're all loving. So this will probably be Tuesday. This will be finished Tuesday. Well, finished with you. I'll have to finish it afterwards. Yep, I like that. Where did I get to then? Um, did I do something with that robin? Did I put a... Where was the Robin page there? No, didn't put anything on it. I wondered about that mistletoe tuck with the Robin. No. It's quite 
quite nice on there with that though, but I wouldn't put it on there as a tuck. It's not really strong paper that if it went on there, it would just be as a an embellishment. Well, that's the page that I put that beautiful. Where are you? <laughs> that one, isn't it? Those beautiful birds. Oops, lid. <clears throat> I've just spotted this as well that I've got. I brought this, which I thought would be nice. So this is the lap, not on this blue, not on this page, but that will make a nice uh, tuck pocket. So that might be the one that goes in the front. I don't know, we'll see. And then some of these will just have lace on them. Okay, let's see if there's anything else that I'm desperate to get in now. And then if not, We might call it a day. Oh, no. I wanted that in, didn't I? Because it was, I said it was real traditional, but it may well end up just going over a page with a lovely um, yes. Tell me what it is. Oh, I've got a star one. Look, that's very Christmassy, isn't it? It's a paper clip. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. So we'll find something to put in there. We might decorate the outside of it with something pretty. Again, lovely gold pen on there. Oops, sorry, that's probably a yes. And it did want dusting. I'll do it now. The shame of it. <laughs> um. Yeah, I don't think I'll do any more now. I think I'll hang on. What did I put on there? Some holly. We'll find something pretty to put on there. I quite like him. What do we think? He goes quite nice down there, doesn't he? Yeah, I'm going to put him on. If you like it, do it because... And again, we'll have a label across the top of some description. Christmassy label. I know I've got some in my other um, box of fuzzy cuts. Because I took the only one out of here, didn't I, of the Tim Holtz one. Oops. Let's get his tail glued down. Goodness. I know as soon as I sit down down there, I'm going to have a little cat on my knee as well. Because he's been, I think he's been looking at me to sit down <laughs> and have a cuddle all day. So he deserves one, doesn't he? After waking me up all the time, I curse him for waking me up in the middle of the night. I expect we'll be awake tonight at every little creek. Because it's not, the handle is, it's secure-ish. Um, but he's had to order parts, so it's going to be a couple of days and it's... It's Sunday tomorrow, isn't it? No, it's Saturday tomorrow. You don't think they'll be here until Monday, so we'll be on. Mind, we'll have the ring. Um, oh, you're coming undone. I thought I'd must not have done it in that place. I stuck it down because it is only cheap washy. I stuck it down with uh, this art glitter. Oh, yeah, this is put enough on. There we go. I mean, it doesn't matter really if it's loose, does it? It's still protecting it, but I'd much prefer it to be stuck down. Okay, well, I have to say that's cheered me up a bit just uh, looking at the beautiful Christmassy pages here. I certainly would love to own this. Um, but, you know, I can only own so many, so many journals. I definitely can feel there that... Uh, that card. But I don't think it will be forever. Right, where was that? I was talking about putting that in. Yeah, I can't put that in there a lot because it's completely the wrong colour. So that definitely will go in there. Um, so yeah, I just need to put two eyelets in and decide what I'm going to tie it with. So you will see this at the beginning of next week and it should have moved on quite a bit and we will just embellish it. And it'll be ready to go okay so thank you if you stayed with me through 
um, yeah, another another um, chatty and messy video, but um, these things come to try us, don't they? And I will see you tomorrow, which is book page, yeah. Okie dokie. Have a lovely evening and stay safe. See you all soon. Bye for now.